All right, ladies and gentlemen, introducing you to the two fighters. Again, here we fight three by two minute rounds. This one is in the heavyweight division. Introducing to you first, standing across in the blue corner from the Shark Tank gym. Give it up. This is Isaac Wilson. And his opponent standing across in the red corner, fighting out of the NTG Fight and Fitness Gym. This is Otto Telekai. Here we go, folks. 4EP presents Boxing Bazaar 3, Corporate Fight number 2. We are about to go. It's Isaac Wilson out of the Shark Tank gym out of the blue corner. He's in the black trunks with gold trimmings. Up against NTG's very own Otu, the terrorizer Talakai, trained by Steve Wahanko. This has all the makings of a real belter, Nathan DiCarlo. Two big boys in the ring. Here we go. Yeah, and plenty of support for Otu Talakai. Obviously, it's his home promotion so I'm sure you'll hear plenty of noise coming from that corner as well, Wilson, Wilson with an early uh, yeah. touch up straight to Talakai's noggin yeah Wilson starts very fast left right hand both landing as Talakai tries to get it back gee you wouldn't want to get hit with one of uh, Talakai's windmills he's already given us a little preview in the opening seconds here yeah you can see he's got the height and reach advantage definitely over his opponent and Wilson now as uh, the big fella in Talakai starts to find his rhythm. Good shots landed, though, by Wilson. Just using the space in the ring at the moment. Yeah, he's, he's punching up, so he's coming underneath uh, Talakai's vision at times, and that's why I think he's caught him by surprise early on in the piece here, because it's very hard when, you, when your eye vision, the shots are coming under your eye vision, sometimes you miss them. Talakai here having his moments. Both fighters with an impressive uh, showing to begin with. Uh, as you say, Nathan, it's, uh, it, it sometimes can be easier punching up, can't it? Oh, definitely. I mean, it's punching straight is the easiest. Punching up, I find, is easier because you've got a big body you can hit as well. Uh, but, yeah, when, when the punches are coming up underneath you, sometimes you, you miss them, like I said. It, these are better shots here from Talakai, as I say that. Talakai really starting to open up now on Wilson. There's another big right. He's got Wilson on the back foot at the moment. He's got to use all his height and reach advantages there. He had, he had his opponent to the ropes. He needs to keep him there. He's got all, all those advantages, like I said. He needs to use them to bully his opponent to the, to the ropes. Credit to Wilson, though. Oh. oh, big right there from Talakai. That stung Wilson. Yeah, he's, he's definitely feeling it with 10 seconds to go in this round. He wants to see it out, that's for sure. Oh, Right hand just missing there from Talakai. Oh, big right, miss. the finish from the Terrorizer as well. But uh, plenty going for him, Isaac Wilson. He, I mean, I thought he did all right in that opening yeah, round, mate. That first minute, he did, did really well. But I think uh, after that, Talakai started to find his feet, tried to uh, start to find his distance, and then he started taking over. You could see he owned that second half of that round. And you can see... If things keep on going the way they are, it's his fight to lose. Now, of course, these are the big boys. Just talk us through. It is a corporate fight, Nate, but just talk us through uh, this particular cap on the weight for this one. Um, it's heavyweight, so it's 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 120 kilos is is the is that was the catch weight. I I, I got told. So both boys, you can see. I mean, Talakai is a lot bigger, but. I was going to say, Tal kilos, that's, that's, a, that's a big man. Must have just made it under 120, uh, Wilson and Talakai. Round number two, Isaac Wilson out of Shark Tank, Jim, and Talakai trains at NTG. NTG Fight and Fitness, of course, in Logan in Brisbane. Slacks Creek, to be exact. Wilson certainly holding his own. Yeah, I think from Talakai's perspective, he just got to, he's got to see out the first minute. That's when that's when uh, Wilson is very energetic. He's got his energy, but after that, you can see the tide turn. So, uh, if you can see out that first minute and, and start pressuring after that, I think we'll have more success, Talakai. And then conversely, Nathan, would you say Wilson probably needs to hang out for the last 30 to 45 seconds of the round, maybe? Oh, yeah. oh big shot there from Talakai. Oh, here we go. As we just say, that is three and four shots, and when you turn your back to your opponent you're usually hurt and he looks very hurt Wilson 
They're having a really good look at him here. They're not sure if they're going to let him continue or not. They're having a no, and that's probably that's probably a smart move because I think it was all going one way. After that big shot landed, he felt very uncomfortable in there, Wilson. And I think that was a great call by the referee. Yeah, I agree with you, Nathan. Of course, credit to uh, both gents as we have a look at some of the highlights. Isaac Wilson, I mean, he probably gave up 20 kilos there. Credit to him. Takes a brave man. Have a look at the sight of the terrorizer Talakai. Goodness gracious me. Yeah, you could see he had all the advantages in there. He just, oh, look at that shot. He caught him and he was doing some sort of Irish dance there. That was... A really good stoppage by the referee. I respect that. As we head to James O'Shea, our MC. Your referee calls a halt to the action. Your winner by TKO coming from the red corner. Otto Talakai. As we make it official, congratulations to Otto the terrorizer Talakai living up to his name. Defeating Isaac Wilson, corporate fight number two. Plenty more action to come.